This video was made in collaboration with Narutopedia. For more information, check out the link in the description. The History of Team 7 from Naruto Team 7 was a Konohagakure team formed under the leadership of Kakashi Harake. Two and a half years after Sasuke Uchiha left the village, Kakashi filled out paperwork to form Team Kakashi, with his former pupils Naruto Uzumaki and Sakura Haruno now being treated as equals alongside their teacher. Following Yamato and Sai joining the team, the group went by Team Yamato during the former's leadership. Welcome to the Amagi! In today's video, we're going over the history of Team 7. Before we begin, we publish a new video every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Naruto, Sasuke, and Sakura are organized into a team following their graduation from the academy in order to balance out their talents. Naruto, the worst student in his class, would benefit from Sakura's intelligence and Sasuke's proficiency with ninjutsu. Sakura would benefit from her more battle-capable teammates. Sasuke would benefit from being forced to work with others. Kakashi is selected to lead them in order to keep an eye on Naruto, Ninetales Jinchuriki, and in the anime to help Sasuke cope with life after the Uchiha clan downfall, and as well as to develop his Sharingan. As with all the previous Genin teams he was put in charge of, Kakashi gives them a bell test in order to determine if they give the proper importance to teamwork. Unlike all previous Genin teams, Naruto, Sasuke, and Sakura pass the test. Team 7's early missions are all D rank, which Naruto believes they are overqualified for. He's able to pressure the third Hokage into giving them a C rank mission, escorting Tazuna to the Land of Waves. After starting the mission, they discover that Tazuna lied about the mission details, and the mission is actually A rank, far above the skills of a Genin. Despite this, Team 7 sticks with the mission and is able to see it through to its completion. When they return to Konoha, they resume their menial D rank assignments, but from their performance, Kakashi believes they are qualified to participate in the Chunin exams. Despite strong showings from all three, particularly Naruto and Sasuke, none succeeded in becoming Chunin. In the anime, they go on a few additional missions, but events during and after the Chunin exams lead Sasuke to believe that his membership in the team is preventing him from achieving his goal of killing his brother, Itachi. He defects from Konoha, joining forces with Orochimaru. Sakura tries to convince him not to, Naruto is unable to stop him, and by the time Kakashi learns of what Sasuke has done, it was already too late. In the aftermath, Naruto leaves the village to train with Jiraiya, and Sakura becomes the disciple of Tsunade, in effect disbanding Team 7. When Naruto returns to the village after two and a half years, he, Sakura, and Kakashi form a reborn Team 7. Kakashi gives them another bell test, but this time the only objective is to demonstrate how their skills have improved. As the team's first mission, they are sent to Sunagakure to rescue the 5th Kazakage from Akatsuki, for which task they are reorganized into the Kazakage Rescue Team upon arrival in Suna. During the course of their mission, they learn of an opportunity to reunite with Sasuke, but Kakashi overexerts himself and needs extended bed rest when they return to Konoha. Because they only have a limited amount of time to make use of the intel, an Anbu codenamed Yamato is assigned as Kakashi's replacement. To provide additional manpower to the team, Sai of Root is added to the team as Sasuke's replacement. Although the team is successful in infiltrating one of Orochimaru's hideouts and meeting with Sasuke, his growth over the last few years is more than any of them can compete with, and they can do nothing but let him escape. From the mission, however, Sai becomes a trusted and lasting member of the team, and Yamato takes on a recurring role as leader and advisor to Team 7's members, especially as Kakashi increasingly commits himself to other tasks. When a Kakashi-led Team Asuma struggles in another confrontation with Akatsuki, Yamato leads Team 7 in providing backup. Shortly afterwards, when they come up with a plan to find Sasuke by first finding Itachi, a Yamato-led Team 7 combines with a Kakashi-led Team 8 into the 8-man squad. The 8-man squad is unsuccessful in stopping Sasuke from falling into the clutches of the Akatsuki. When, following Pain's assault, recent news of Sasuke's criminal activity with Akatsuki reaches Konoha, Naruto tries to secure a pardon from him from the Raikage, who refuses. Meanwhile, Sasuke's former classmates decide that they should be the ones to personally kill him for what he's done and to prevent chaos his actions could bring. Sakura accepts the responsibility, yet plots to kill him on her own due to Sai's unwittingly encouraging her to do so, but ultimately can't bring herself to do so and nearly lost her life. Kakashi, on learning of her plans and believing the crisis to be his responsibility due to his own failure to prevent Sasuke from going rogue, offers to do it himself as Sasuke's former teacher. Naruto intervenes before anybody is able to kill anyone else, in the process reuniting all of Team 7's original members for the first time in three years. Naruto and Sasuke briefly clash, but both accept that they are too evenly matched and postpone a final resolution between them for another time. Despite the nature of their prior meeting, all the members of Team 7 emerge on the same side during the 4th Shinobi World War, with not even Sasuke wanting the world to fall victim to the infinite Tsukiyomi. They join forces first against the Tentails, 
Then it's Jinchuriki Obito Uchiha, and then Madara Uchiha, but through various setbacks and despite various successes, the world is enslaved by the infinite Tsukiyomi. Sasuke is able to protect Naruto, Sakura, and Kakashi from the infinite Tsukiyomi's effects, leaving them the only ones to face a new and final threat, Princess Kaguya Otsutsuki. After a prolonged fight, Kakashi is able to create an opening with assistance from Obito. Sakura is able to block Kaguya's escape, and Naruto and Sasuke are able to seal her, ending the war. However, Sasuke revealed his alliance with them was a means to an end, stating his plan to start a revolution by killing the tailed beasts and the current Kage. Naruto opposes him, and they fight in order to settle their feud once and for all. Ultimately, after they're injured to the point of being unable to move, and each losing a respective arm, Sasuke surrenders and accepts his friendship with Naruto. For his contributions during the war, Sasuke is pardoned for his previous crimes on the good words of Naruto and Kakashi. He realigns himself with Konoha, but leaves the village to wander the world. At the same time, Kakashi becomes the 6th Hokage, and Naruto, Sai, and Sakura all take on new roles, effectively disbanding Team 7 on good terms. Over the next several years, Naruto marries Hinata Hyuga, and they have two children, Boruto and Himawari. Naruto succeeds Kakashi as the 7th Hokage. Sasuke and Sakura get married and have a daughter, Sarada, and Sai marries Ino, with whom he has a son, Inojin. Years later, Boruto and Sarada, alongside Orochimaru's son Mitsuki, are placed together for their Genin team. Influenced by their parents' past, Sarada requested that their assigned team designation be changed from Team 3 to Team 7, which Naruto granted. Did you enjoy our video? Be sure to check out these other great videos from the Amagi, and make sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.